Okay, what's up guys? This is a really weird view, but <laughs> I'm on my way to John right now because I'm gonna be painting my bumper, like I said. Unfortunately, I can't film due to the location that we're working on today. Tomorrow, I'm going to Danny's place and I'm gonna paint the rear bumper. Today's more so like a practice run. Getting a hang of painting and the process uh, from John, cause John is basically, well he went to school for it, right? Uh, okay, I can't see you guys. Okay, I just arrived at the location. Well, I'm about to go in and get this painted ASAP, so shoots. Um, anyway, so today I am heading over to Highline. Um, it's a paint store um, here in Oahu. I'm heading there right now because um, John and I painted the bumper yesterday, or John did, and I kind of basically just watched him how he does it. Most of the spray can that he bought was from Highline. Um, I am going to buy a surface cleaner, sandpaper, 2K clear, which is something that I can't get anywhere besides that place on this island. As far as the process goes, I guess I could talk about it a little bit. The way we did it yesterday, we basically sanded down with 320 grit sandpaper, cleaned the surface, a primer on places that needs a little work. He didn't prime the whole entire bumper, he basically just primed the places that will probably gonna peel and stuff. And then basically scuff it down with purple, like spongy, sandy thingy that I also need to buy actually. And scuff it down and then go over it with the base coat. Um, so painting technique to like he did it in a hot paint. It's just like an overlapping method. That's what you call it. Uh, it came out really good actually. Um, it's in the back right now. It's still drying. Um, I just left it in my mom's car and just I'm heading to the paint shop with it because I don't have any other car to drive right now. But yeah, I'm really excited because. It came out so good on the rear bumper and hopefully I can use the same strategy to do the same for the rear bumper. I don't think it's gonna come out as nice as the way John did, but I'll try my best to do so. Alright, so I just came back home and I'm about to do a little haul. I just want to say a full review on Highline. I'll give them 12 out of 10 for such a great selection and knowledgeable employees and they were super helpful with me. I understand that everyone wants to cheap out on paint and I totally get it. I was one of them but if you want something nice you gotta spend the money and I realize that now with John's recommendation and going to Highline and in Oahu if you're doing something really like a little bit more professional type of paint. Highline is the place to go. So any question you probably have, they can answer it for you. It's probably the only place on the island that does where they can get your original paint and put it in a can for you so that you can take it home with a can and you can do it yourself. So super cool. Um, appreciate all your help today. Um, I just wanted to give it a shout out. You know, because amazing shop. Um, anyway, so what I got, scuff pads. Um, one is a like a purple one and then the gray one. The gray one is more finer. It's about like 600 grit. This is like rough. Don't know how much grit that is. Anyway, next, sandpaper. Um, John taught me to get a thousand grit, but I didn't get it because I don't remember using it yesterday, so we're just gonna 
do 320 and 600. Next, primer. So this primer, we used it yesterday. It was real good. Um, this is one of the selection they have that they carry on um, this brand. Um, this was really good. Uh, surface cleaner. I have been using alcohol my whole life just to clean the surface. Yeah, I guess you can do it. Well, I'm not a painter, so don't ask me how to do things right. But this is just what John was using it. And I just basically copied. How original. Okay. Anyway, next, 2K Clear. You know, I've never thought I would get a 2K Clear on Island because I try ordering online, it's like, they don't ship here because it's a can, so it's explosive, it's dangerous, so you have to get it shipped by a distributor, which is Highline. So they can do it, and ours only, whatever, but they don't carry those. 2K Clear, only available at 2 uh, Highline. Anyway, um, this one, we used it yesterday. It looks so good right now in the back. I don't know if you guys can see the little shine. Camera. I don't know if you guys can see. It's pretty good. Um, I'm still drying this, you know. But I mean, oh, like I don't know. It's so good. It's so good. It's 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 perfect. It's perfect. Uh, I bought two cans of those just in case because I might be covering a lot of places today. Next, this like a sanding block thing. Uh, I think I'll use this pretty often so bought it. That's it from Highline. Then I went to AutoZone because AutoZone only carries my color match paint for different color. I've already um, bought like six cans of it so the nearest location they are out of stock. <laughs> so I have to drive a little bit farther but they had it. Uh, they only had three though, so I don't know how we're gonna make that work, but we'll try our best. Um, anyway, so we got three of them here. Okay, well that is it, and we are going to go upstairs, drink some orange juice, drink some coffee, and I'm gonna go to my car, take off the bumper, start scuffing. So when I get to Danny's house, it's ready for me. Let's go! So I'm at Danny's house, already set up the bumper and the garnish and we're about to sand it down. As you can see the condition is super bad. It's getting all comfortable out here. <laughs> Uh, yeah, you're in frame now. Okay, so, uh, Daddy and I, we just cleaned it up and did all the stuff we need to do, which is sand and then clean it with a surface cleaner. And now I'm going to fill in some... Ah! Now I'm going to fill in some spots, you know, with the primer. That's what I'm doing. <laughs> Why is it not shaking well? I don't know. <laughs> what the f How how long do I have to shake for? Yeah. Okay. He's doing his best way. I I I really am. <laughs>
Alright, I just lay down probably like four session or four quotes. Trying to get a good look. You lay down pretty nicely, smooth, and looks good. Looks honestly really good. Really happy with it. I mean, no drip, a uh, little bit of drip down there, but it's all pretty. So, yeah, nice paint. I used about three, almost four cans to do both of these, so yeah, it's pretty even in my opinion. Yeah. I mean, it looks a lot better, especially the bumper. It was really bad. So, here's Danny. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna wait like five more minutes and I'm gonna go ahead and start throwing some clear on. <laughs> yeah, better, shake that. You better give me good tips for this throw. <laughs> I swear to God. <laughs> <laughs> okay, go off. Okay, I just came back from Danny's place and yeah, that's how it looks. It's pretty shiny. I mean, there's some uneven spots, but looks good from a far away. It's shiny, that's the most important thing. Here's the bumper. Okay, so it has been two days since all the painting. It has been drying for a while. Honestly, it looks super good. Like, it looks, it looks really good. Really happy with the way it came out for that one too. And the front bumper. I think I'm gonna put the rear bumper back on first and then do the front. Okay, so I finished. I finished putting the rear bumper on and this is how it looks. Look at that shine, really. Um, I'm gonna show you guys like the full reveal later, so I have to still buff it and stuff. It looks really good. That needs to be repainted. But that's for another day. Now, I'm gonna put the front bumper back on, so let's do that.
this is basically the end of today's video. It came out so good. Like this color matching is insane. Um, I'm so excited to take this out for a little drive after this and then take some pictures and I'll probably post it on TikTok or Instagram. I don't know. So excited. I am so happy with it. I can't wait. Um, to get this paint in next. But that's probably for another video. Make sure you guys follow all my social media. Give it a thumbs up if you guys like this video. Comment down below if you guys have any questions. I can do my best ability to help you guys. But with that being said, thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll see you guys on the next video. Peace out.